Hello and welcome back to my channel. My name is Hannah if you're new here and today I'm going to be showing you five different ways to crop your sweatshirt without having to cut it. I personally don't like cutting my clothing and if you don't either, hopefully this video is helpful for you. If you're not already following me on Instagram and TikTok, be sure to do that. My username is at Hannah Whirling and let's get started. So the first look is actually quite easy. What I usually do is I wear a sports bra underneath my sweatshirt to be able to tuck it in. I'm just going to take the bottom material and you're going to tuck it up into your sports bra. You will tuck it all the way around. You can do as much or as little as you like. You'll probably have parts that are uneven at first, but that's okay. You can just adjust until it looks the way that you want it. So this is probably the easiest way to do that tuck. I really like the way this one personally looks and I do wear it quite a bit. The only downside to this one is that if you are moving around a lot, even with the sports bra, usually the material will fall out a little bit throughout the day. So for the second look, we're going to be doing a front twist. It's quite easy. You just bring the material out to the front and you are going to twist it around until it's comfortable for you. Then you're just going to tuck this part up into that sports bra material so it will look like this and then just adjust it as you need it. I would say that this look is very cute. I like the twist in the front. It does stay longer than the traditional tuck. The only downside to this one is that you may have fabric in the back that hangs out a little bit more than the front, but I sometimes like that look anyway, so it's not really a problem. So for the next one, it's actually quite easy. We are going to be doing something similar to the twist, but we are going to be doing it on either side. So take one side and I just twist it around just a little bit like that. And then you're gonna tuck it up into the sports bra. This one stays quite well. You're gonna do the same thing on the other side here. So you're just going to twist and then tuck it up into the sports bra. So this is what this style looks like. I really like this one. I feel like it stays super nicely. It looks snug, but you don't have to have all of the material tucked up into the sports bra, so it's not quite as bulky and it's less uncomfortable. So next we are going to be doing the fourth one, which is the fold up. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna take the material on your sweatshirt and start rolling it up. Usually you'll have this kind of cinched base, so it'll make it easier. And then roll upwards. You won't need very much, usually just like two rolls it'll look something like this and then you're gonna take this fold and you're gonna tuck it up into the sports bra tuck it all the way around this one is quite bulky underneath and this one does give the most cropped look of any of them it's quite a high crop so if you feel uncomfortable showing this amount of skin I would say this one probably isn't for you but if you have like a very high waisted jean or something like that I think that this can be really really cute or potentially if you're going to style it with a skirt I think that this can be a super good option for you. This one is probably the most secure of all of them. This is not going to fall out all day, but the only issue with this one is that it is quite bulky up inside the sports bra, so it doesn't feel as comfortable. So for the last and final look, we are going to be knotting the sweatshirt. If you really care about your sweatshirt and you don't want it to stretch or anything, I would not recommend this one. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna take the sweatshirt like this and pull it just like like that and then you will actually twist it kind of like you're doing a bun and then pull it like this so it will look something like that and then what I like to do is I like to use a hair tie and you can actually hold the look with a hair tie if your sweatshirt is stretchy enough you can just knot it on the outside if you want to but if you are using hair tie like I am I like to actually tuck this up underneath and so you're gonna get this kind of side knotted look I think this is super cute very comfortable this is another one that's quite secure it's not really gonna go anywhere throughout the day but you will have some extra fabric in the back so it really only crops the front for any of these styles you can also use a hair tie to hold it and tuck it as well if you want a little bit more security with your sweatshirt. I want to thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully this video was helpful for you. If you have not checked out my other videos already, be sure to head over to my channel to do that. I have more hair care, fashion, skincare, and more, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!